we're in our happy place. I didn't get up as early as I wanted to this morning, even though I woke up at five. I went back to sleep. And we're gonna do our little morning walk. I don't think I'm gonna bring my camera with me again, because this is annoying to carry, but. we will put it in the back. Start walking the boardwalk and see how far we go. Got this feeling. I'm feeling you could be the one. I see no reason why I should ever let you go. Mm -hmm. I don't wanna wake up if I'm dreaming because you know I can't get enough of this feeling you're giving me. Don't wanna wake up. No, I don't wanna wake up. Okay. We did a mile and a half to our little uh, Black Rock nook. Yes. Um, I would go further this morning if I hadn't forgotten my headphones and the kids weren't already begging us for breakfast. And I was like, it's in the freezer. There's waffles in the freezer. There's juice in the fridge. We went and got stuff at a Safeway last night. So um, we're going to go back and make sure that they know how to put a waffle in the toaster. <laughs> um, Ashley's worried she forgot to take her medicine last night. so. Go home and reassure her she'll be okay. I've been pretty adamant that she take it every day, so she's kind of worried about it. It's windy. I'm gonna get a little muff put on. All right. As much as we don't want to take a scenic drive over to Costco <laughs> today, we do have to go over and stock up on groceries. Um, left the kids back in the room. They are gonna um, finish getting something to eat and get their swimsuits on. They're gonna go play in the pool and just relax and hang out while we are getting groceries. And then I think the consensus was to go to Black Rock today. Uh, some of us want to do the beach, some of us want to do cliff diving, and others want to just hang out and lay out. So I think it's the Black Rock is perfect place for that. But I'm having to find out if there are any boogie boards in our closet, in our condo. What did Kaylee say? There's none. Okay. So we're gonna have to be on a mission to find boogie boards because that is a must for every beach that we like to go to, correct? Yeah, no point going to a beach unless you can play in the water. Yeah, so we'll have to go to Goodwill over here and see if we can find some. If not, there's a few little rental places on the Lahaina side. But stay tuned. I will probably just do a separate video for Costco, like I mentioned last night. Um, just to keep it separate from like our daily videos. All right, after much ado, to get everyone packed up for the beach. We have some snacks packed. We have five kids in the back. And yes, Jacob, I count you as a child still. We have to go and rent a boogie board. Jason and I tried four different, three different places. None of them had any, including Costco, which we didn't want to pay 50 bucks for one board. I can't prop you up in this car. Um, so we're gonna go and rent some for the week. Oh. Wow. Oh, that's gonna hit. Oh, oh dear. So, we're gonna go rent some buggy boards and head to Black Rock for the afternoon. Okay, got everyone here. It's a little windy. Let's see how well we just plug the board back if you need any lock the car. Oh, I hope it's not as windy down on the beach.
well, I look like a mess. Um, that's very short lived. Right when we were seeing turtles, which we'll talk about later, all of a sudden we hear Abby screaming at us. She had just jumped off Black Rock when I missed it. And when she plugged her nose to jump in, when she hit the water, her hand slipped and she has fake nails on and her thumbnail completely sliced her eyebrow. And it's like a long slice. And it's bleeding all the way down her face. She didn't notice at first until she was trying to fix her little swimsuit. Had blood down on her chest. Um, so, we're packing up. Jason's gonna drop me and her off at urgent care. He'll run everyone back to the hotel to get showered and cleaned up. Maybe they'll just go to the pool. But I think we need to get dinner tonight, so maybe they'll just get cleaned up. And, uh, okay, we're all cleaned up. I'll explain everything in a minute. Abby doesn't like to be on camera. Huge rainbow. Light at the end of the tunnel, people. Okay, we've come down to Lahaina. We are hoping to find dinner somewhere. Dad gets embarrassed when, no, the kids get embarrassed when I have the camera out. And I'm trying to cross the street. I don't know, they're laughing behind me. But Dad has had a, a little uh, chip on his shoulder about having to get the larger car. You should have filmed me parking. I, I know, also. I should have. But I was having to guide you in. But we pulled up to the best spot. If you've been here, we literally pulled up in front of the, right by the parrots and a perfect spot. And it does not look busy at Cool Cats. Here we go. We have never seen a chicken climb a tree. He's in there? Nope. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Hey, bud. Don't come in. He's in there. Oh, there. Oh, there's two. No, that's enough. All right, we had a great dinner. Uh, what? Well, he's chasing chickens. Yeah. Oh, there's baby chickens over here. I'm fast enough to catch those chickens. There's some baby. Okay, we're gonna go show Jacob the banyan tree. And then we're gonna just sight see and walk through town here a little bit. And then we're gonna get shave ice. When we all kind of had they all have burgers that were kind of heavier. Jason and I did not eat the bun. They're all laughing at me. Yeah, because you're funny. You will, you will no, no, no. No, this is not cool. You do not go against me. No. What's on me? Nothing's on you. No, this is not funny. I do all this work and then you guys do something to me. Get back here. Tell me what is wrong. He's photobombing all your videos. <laughs> I will find out when I edit, yes. Okay, okay, fine. So if you are new to Maui videos, we've already been here now four times, Jason and I have. This is the banyan tree. Action. <laughs> Jason's making me be in front of the camera. This is the banyan tree. Now, I don't know what else to say about it. It's really old and all the little roots all stem from one main tree. P is over there making fun of it.
Okay, one thing Ashley has wanted so bad is a pair of Crocs, her first pair of Crocs, correct? Yeah, because I've been, so wearing, what did we find? I've been wearing these, but I want like keys on them. I know, she wants to be able to put stuff on them. So we finally got them. Yeah, Are you happy? Because I see so many at school that just drop and I'm like. We're gonna super glue them on. So Jacob, do you want to say what you found in your pocket? Not really. <laughs> you found your nuts. I found walnuts. <laughs> uh, they ended up there from the parrots, right? Yes. The, the birds put them in his pocket. Yes. So we did see the parrots, but you're not around allowed to like film camera videos or anything around it. Totally respect the guy. We got the same person. Um, as we did two years ago, so I'll obviously show you the picture once we get it. Um, you'll see it here, but um, it's going to be fun to like come back in the, different it takes time in the next yeah. couple years and just keep like getting the, the same photos like the done with the parrots because like, it's just it's, a little bumpy. it's yeah, so fun. It's, it's nice. quite the experience. If you come, get a picture with the parrots. Just get the smallest package if you can't really afford it, but it's the photo and the experience of being with the birds, wouldn't you say? It's super fun. It's super yeah, fun. It's super cute pictures. He's a good, good photographer too. Yeah, he's a really good photographer and he's good with his birds and he's good with people. So, highly suggest that. We're just enjoying Lahaina as we kind of close out our night. Okay, we're back at our room. The kids are out there getting into trouble. But I have their cute little Easter bags I was going to give them. They've all kind of seen the general idea that I have something. They just don't know what it is. So I made their cute little bags and mine, there's six of them there and mine is right there because I didn't waste <laughs> getting another bag, but I did get myself a treat. So we're out there making smoothies and filling up our ice waters because we're all very thirsty and I'm going to take these out there to them now. Open the door, open the door. Okay. Happy Easter everyone. Late Easter. Late Easter. She's going down to the hot tub. As they're touching your feet. Why are we touching your feet? Oh dear. Okay. Oh, they're not all the same. Hang on one second. They are specific to you. So hang on. Okay, everyone like what they got? You got caramel. You got regular. You like your Kit Kats? <laughs> Jacob, what did, what did Jason say in the car today? He said... Yogurt. Jason, what's it you said in the car today about Jacob? He said, sometimes people want to slap you. Sometimes people really want to. So I, I can understand I why sometimes know. people want to slap you. I just, yeah. The funniest thing is no one's ever slapped me. Let me be the first. <laughs> and I didn't say that out of like. No, no, no. We're all just joking. Oh, okay. We like him being here. Yeah, sure. Yes, the camera is still rolling. We're we're trying to be nice about Jacob on camera. Just kidding. We're having a great. Eyelashes. <laughs> Chelsea, did you just put M and M's on your ice cream? I would never. Very creative. We're making smoothies. Do you want some? You know, we brought these little containers called cups for that very reason. Okay, so we don't break these cups, babe. Okay, then here. here. I don't need it. I just want to put it into the plastic cup so our children don't break, break the glass goblets. Okay, I think we're going to, I think one kid is going to the hot tub. Is anyone going with you or is just dad taking you down? I didn't need to go down. We're gonna call it a night with you guys. I don't want to call it night in general, but we'll see what these guys do. Um, I gotta start putting put you it together. You said he would go down, so you're going. No, Dad said he would go down. No, you didn't. I did not say he would go down. I said you could go down. Dad, there's a difference. Okay, good night, you guys. Day one, official day one. We packed a lot in. Um, I didn't really talk about Abby's um, cut. eyebrow, her cut. Um, I'll have already shown you some of the footage of that. I'll come in here. Um, so yeah, she did slice open her, did I even tell you how this happened? I don't think I have. So Abby jumped off Black Rock before we could even finish snorkeling. <laughs> we barely even started snorkeling at Black Rock. And she jumped off, Jacob was right, I think, had Jacob already jumped off? Uh, yeah. Or he did right after her. Anyway, Abby jumped off, plugged her nose, and her thumb Ashley, as she Ashley. went underwater. Her no, thumb. This, she had her hand. Yeah, out, I'm taking like, my glasses off. Her hand was like this, and so then her. her yeah, her arm was out in front of her instead of down to her side. Yeah. But her thumb 
when she hit the water, it just sliced straight up into her eyebrow. It like she doesn't like to be on camera, and so I I fully respect that. She doesn't mind the photos that we've taken. We've discussed the photos that we've taken. But it was an absolute no-go on pulling out the camera, and I will always respect my kids' opinion on whether they want to be filmed or not. Um, but she doesn't mind me showing you like kind of the before and the after with her stitches. Took her to urgent care, a little pricey, but they they know you don't have insurance that can cover Hawaii, so they just put a price tag on it. Um, but they got her stitched up, they had four stitches because the cut was going vertical. They can't glue it shut. And she is a no-go for the water for the rest of the week. Can't put water, pool or ocean water on it, but it's fine. She's got her jump done from Black Rock. And Bailey. she can be in the pool, and usually she just likes to get in up to her shoulders and kind of get cooled off and be in the water, and then she likes to lay out. That's more her personality. And um, if we go and snorkel, um, we might try and cheat and put the full snorkel mask on um, before she even enters the water and she'll be able to, it's a fully submerged um, snorkel mask as you've seen, so it'll completely cover her eye um, if she wants to get in. Um, otherwise she can just kind of splash in the water um, and enjoy it from the shore side. So um, luckily she's not as much of the water baby as Chelsea is. Chelsea is no, it's not me. You didn't see Chelsea in the water today, she didn't get in the water. She's very concerned about her ears. Did not get in the ocean today. So we're gonna work on the that. Last time she was crying, um, it hurt so bad. Yeah, so she has a little PTSD. This is kind of a recap of the whole night or the whole day, because I just haven't really been able to like sit down and chat with you guys. It was just kind of go, go, go. Um, so hopefully we can kind of get over that, you know, the horrible time Chelsea has had over the past couple of years with her ears and get her more comfortable back in the water. Um, in fact, I think she's done her ear treatments once or twice today. So she should be good. But <laughs> as everyone has said, wow, we packed a lot into today. <laughs> we did, we had a great time. Um, Maui is just, it has our heart and we don't care if we have injuries or urgent care visits or we just go because it's so fun here. So thank you for joining us. Stick around if you are new and coming for Maui videos. We are going, we're here for seven more days. So lots more content to come and then hopefully you'll join our family um, going forward because uh, I don't know I think we're kind of fabulous and <laughs> we have a fun time together so take care and we'll see you guys next time. Mahalo. Easy, easy.